a little over a year ago, um, like February or something. I just um, kind of threw it out there on Facebook. Okay, what would I do to start a community garden? Like I didn't even know where to start. I thought, well, you know, I, somebody would give me a hint. And um, the president of the neighborhood watch said, we should do that, we should do that here. And so we just started talking to people and we started looking at properties in, in the area. This particular one happened to have a house on it, but um, somebody in community programs knew that the house was to be demolished and that it would not be rebuilt. Upon hearing that, we started making inquiries, like could we change the zoning so that we could utilize it. I, I think I would have been floundering and not knowing where to start otherwise, but um, that, it really gave us something to stand for. The city has been wonderful and incredibly supportive. Neighbors have reached out um, to us to offer their help, offer some materials. The Neighborhood Watch is, has been essential. That really gave us a foundation, gave us all, all of our connections and um, a core of volunteers. Jamie's a very hardworking person. Uh, she's probably one of the hardest working volunteers that I've ever seen. Her dedication to this garden is just immense. Uh, she takes she, she took the ball and ran with it. Um, we need a lot of people like that, no matter what community you live in. Bringing the community together, involved in uh, a common project, uh, teaching the children uh, the importance and, uh, of growing. We could not be more proud of Jamie. We could not be more grateful to Jamie for what she has helped bring about and from a personal level, I am very thrilled to have her as a friend and neighbor. Here in South Norfolk, we, the, one of our biggest problems is there's as many renters as there are homeowners. And so we have a smaller group of people who are willing to do things. When you have somebody like Jamie step up, it really helps the community. We really want to give the food away. We don't want anything to go to waste. We want to share as much as possible, any excess. We, we want to give to somebody who deserves it, who needs it, and um, who will enjoy it. And I think everybody will. I can't provide enough from my backyard to everybody, but there's no reason everybody can't have a little piece you know, in a place like this. Cox Conserves Heroes is presented by Cox Communications in partnership with the Trust for Public Land.